All right, folks, this video is going to be an update to the previous video I did three years ago on how to set up any controller on Steam, whether that's your PS4 controller, your Xbox controller, or even if you have a generic controller or even the, the Steam controller itself. This video will show you exactly how to do that. Now, if you watch the video from three years ago, it's pretty much going to be the same. The only difference is going to be this icon right here. Um, cause I've had a few people within the last few days say that they do not have big picture mode. Three years ago, this icon was a controller icon. This time around, it is just a little rectangle with two arrows in each corner. So, you would go here, you would click big picture mode. And you're gonna get this little animation that comes up, uh, letting you know that you are in big picture mode. So once you are in big picture mode, you wanna go up here to this gear icon. This is pretty much your settings. Okay, once you, well, so once you click that, uh, you will see all these different options right here. Go down to controller settings. Now, before you get to this point, Okay, likely the controller you have is going to have a USB cord attached to it, come with it, what have you. Make sure that it's not plugged into the computer. Do not plug it into the computer yet when you get to this window. None of these should be checked uh, if you are setting up for the first time. Now, I have the Xbox One set up because that's the last controller I used. Um, I also have a PlayStation controller, so I can hook that up as well. Now is when you will plug in the USB cord. Once you plug it in, whether if it's a PS4 one, Xbox one, you click it, and once you click it, it should, if you have it plugged in, it will ask you if you want to identify it or you want to calibrate it. Um, when you identify it and you click it, it'll vibrate for you, letting you know that it is detected. Uh, once you do that, you pretty much can back out of it. Uh, you can um, go to the game of your choosing. So let's say you go to your library. Let's say I play American Truck Simulator quite a bit. So if I want to set up my controller for American Truck Simulator, I will go to Manage Game. I will go to Controller Configuration. But the thing is, is since I don't have a controller plugged in because I use a steering wheel, um, it won't pop up for me. But if you go into Controller Configuration, uh, you will be able to set your different buttons as to how you want to. Uh, some of them will already be predetermined for you. So simply, if you don't want to use that as an option, you can always clear it out. I will leave a link for the video I did three years ago because that part has not changed. So when you get to this point, you will reference back to the previous video. And that video will show you, you know, how to um, change out different options in your controller. So I just wanted to do a video real quick on how to set up any controller on Steam in 2021, whether if it's a PS4 controller or an Xbox controller. If you have any questions, leave a comment in the comment section below. And again, take care, folks, and I appreciate you for watching.